Hey, what is going on everyone? This is Igor here, and this is going to be a short video as a update to the last video that I did. I forgot to mention a few things, and the first one I want to mention most um, with most urgency, and I want to let you guys know so that if you haven't figured it out and you don't know yet, I want to tell you guys so that you guys can do this. Now, for the Thanksgiving update, they actually made a care relief package or a colonial relief package available to everyone who has been playing the game thus far. So, what what you do to accept that, I'm not going to on this character. Um, I don't I don't want to because it's only I wanted to mention it is account bound when you get it on one character you get it on that account so don't just get it on an alt that's in the middle of nowhere somewhere and think that you're just gonna be able to get it on every character because it doesn't work that way so this is a just kind of a, a side account that I have but I don't want them on this character but what you do is uh, the post office guy right here you just basically right click them and you see right here Postmaster Colonial Relief Package. Um, when you get it, you just click Receive. It'll go in your inventory. And real quick here, I will log out. I will log back in and show you guys. Oh, wrong account. And I'll show you guys what that Colonial Relief Package contains because if you haven't got it yet, it is rather exciting. So this is just a random alt I have. Uh, I think this is Roanoke. I just started one on this server randomly and this is what the care relief package contains when you open it up obviously it's you know nine things that you get you get a 100 seeds of corn seeds which means they can be planted so for all you agriculture guys out there this is for you so you can start growing corn now you get a perfect autumn leaf you get a dream catcher inspirational five nations dream catcher which is pretty good I mean it's not amazing it's not no lovers locket but it's pretty good um, we get a new world gourd we get a dried deer hide um, as Yorb would say himself we get everyone's favorite turkey a dead turkey and we get two cornmeal flatbreads which give quite a bit of blood as far as uh, gluttony goes but it does heal 12 in all your biles and you get two of those so that is the colonial relief package so if you haven't got it go out and get it I really recommend it so that you guys can start growing corn and you can make popcorn and cornmeal flatbread and all that fun stuff so with that said uh, I'm gonna log back out I'm going to log on to my main character here and I want to show you guys something that well they changed for unfortunately the sadder part of the game they fixed it so I'm sorry everybody but you can no longer make four leather with one brain anymore you now actually need you now actually have to have four brains you need four, 40 liters of tanning fluid to tan four leather. So I'm just going to show you guys how that works. Uh, I'm gonna, Like I said, this is another tutorial I have to redo. I'm going to redo my leather making, so if you're watching this and you're not really sure on how to make leather, you've been kind of behind, don't worry. A tutorial is coming for this soon. So I have my bucket. I have, hopefully, a few more buckets. A, two, three. Let's see, I need... I will actually only be able to make three hides. Oh well. So I'm going to make myself some hides here. And I'm going to show you guys what they did. I've tried it already. So I'm going to warn you this probably will raise the market for leather. So if you see people starting to jack the price up on it, don't be surprised. Because I would guess that the market on leather is going to go up kind of high. Because now it's actually slightly expensive to make so I'm gonna go fill up my water here and that's I think it for the things that I missed in the carpentry update from yesterday I wanted to definitely let you guys know about the colonial relief package cuz they didn't really say a whole lot about it so I'm gonna get 10 40 liters of water you don't have to have four buckets you can do this in trips but I just kinda of prefer um, to just do four four buckets because I have them available I only need three but I filled up four anyway well who knows I'll probably have to make some more milk of lime so we're gonna go in my house here I'm gonna get out three brains one two three and I'm gonna show you that 
when you put... Now before, this is the way it worked before, is if you put all your limed hides in, and then you put one bucket of tanning fluid in, the event ending result would, ev would eventually lead to you get four leather or three or how many years in your tanning tub out of one brain. Unfortunately, that no longer works. You only get um, one leather per per brain now, so I'm going to let that sit for a second. Um, there's a couple other things that I'm going to be doing. Uh, keep the questions coming for Q&A. I'm going to answer a few of those. Keep an eye out for, I think, one of the soon videos that I'm going to do. I'm going to be doing the how to kill videos for deer, bear, or not bears, uh, I can't even kill a bear. Um, deer, beavers, crickets, rabbits, and I'm going to do it all with um, well, this guy uh, obviously has 40-something biles, but I'm going to try and kill a deer with just basic uh, punches and roundhouse kicks and stuff like that, so I won't be using my sword. So that way, the deer will kind of have the advantage. You guys will get to see that. I'm also going to be killing crickets and rabbits with my um, lower character. He's only got like 15s, so he's in the 15 range, and then I'm going to be killing beavers with this character as well, because beavers can be kind of a pain. So keep an eye out for that one. That one's coming soon. Let's see here. And these have not ticked up yet. But, um, I, well, man, I hope they do soon, but I wanted to show you what happens when you actually try and do it this way, because it does no longer work. So once I get my corn planted, and once that gets done, um, I will show you guys. I'll do a little video on that because I'm interested to see if uh, you guys haven't messed with agriculture yet. The yeah, right here, the field is the third bar. There's only four bars. There's only four crops. There's cotton, there's wheat, there's cabbage, and pumpkin, and each one does something different to these bars. Well, now we've got a fifth, a fifth plant in there, so I'm interested to see what happens there. So that will be on my docket of things to show you guys. And still nothing, but I assure you that it only works. You know, I'm not even sure. It might not even work, period. I don't know. I didn't really try it this way and wait to see what happened. I just tried four limed hides with one bucket and it, or in with four brains and it worked. So I haven't actually tried to see what would happen. But from what I've heard in a lot of comments, they actually have fixed that. Jor uh, Yorb said it himself in the forums that that has been fixed. So sorry, everybody that has been using that trick. So I'm just going to go ahead and throw in my tanning fluid buckets here. And there's one. There's two. And there we go. So now we got yep, 30 liters for three hides. So that should level out. So, I wanted to tell you guys that. i got a couple more videos I'm working on, so keep an eye out for those. And, as always, guys, thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.